After 29 years, Frank Beamer has announced that 2015 will be his last season at Virginia Tech, and Zach, he truly put this program on the map, taking them to 22 consecutive bowl games. A few men in college football history have made quite an impact at one school as Beamer has in Blacksburg. 279 career wins and counting, many of them coming in a place that had never known success before Frank Beamer, and we really don't know what it's going to look like after he leaves. And in that sense, I put him right there alongside Bill Snyder at Kansas State. Two men that built their programs up from scratch to consistent national forces on the college landscape. Frank Beamer never won a national title, but in that sense, I think he is in rarefied air. This announcement, we now have two major jobs in the ACC Open with Virginia Tech and Miami. Zach, which one of these jobs is going to be more appealing? Miami still comes with the glitz and the glamour, and it has an excellent recruiting base and national titles. But I do think it comes with higher expectations, and that's why I think Virginia Tech is a sneaky good job in the national landscape. They have excellent facilities, certainly a nice base of success, but not too high of expectations. Now, I still think Miami is the major job. It's the one that everybody's going to be looking at, but it's not going to have the greatest facilities. The attendance has not been great when Miami hasn't been great. So I think Virginia Tech is a sneaky good job here. The highs and the lows, though, of Miami, I think, are where they're going to get almost anybody they want in this coaching search. You can win a lot faster there. You've got that great recruiting base in South Florida, but you also have to go against Florida and Florida State, South Florida, UCF, on and on and on as far as fighting for recruits. But the thing about Virginia Tech, while this may be a long-term better job, I do not want to be the guy who follows Frank Beamer in Blacksburg.